Hello everyone, Diamond Archetype, wishing you all well. We're returning today with part two on self-sabotage. And per our last video, <clears throat> we touched on the primary elements surrounding self-sabotage. Now it's time to step it up a notch. Now knowing that self-sabotage is hardwired into us all to stall out our expansion and that we are the ones that hardwires it into ourselves, which is specifically to interfere with our long-term growth. Now, from my perspective, psychic attacks are a form of self-sabotage as well, just recognized in a different light. If we can interfere unconsciously or consciously with our own awakening, then we can do the same with psychic attacks where we are inflicting ourselves with negativity to stall out our awakening further. Now, psychic attacks come from the conscious or unconscious. It's an intention. It's to release negativity or negative energy on someone, with the result being the infliction of harm. Now, this can come in an array of facets on the physical, emotional, spiritual, or mental states of being. Now, let's dissect this a little bit more. If you can psychically attack yourself, which can be considered a form of self-sabotage, with no knowledge of doing so at all, you have to look at it like this. We have the ability to bring ourselves to poor health and help ourselves. Psychic attacks can kind of be viewed the same way. We are in full control of our state of being and our inflictions, whether those are conscious or unconscious from that state of mind. We can consciously or unconsciously unconscious, bring negativity to someone, resulting in the infliction of harm. And we, in fact, can do the same to ourselves. Again, psychic attacks should be just termed as another form of self-sabotage. You know, it's time for us to outgrow karma altogether and walk into an awakening. If we can remove our blocks, then self-sabotage, psychically attacking ourselves, and the psychic attacks committed by other forms or entities can be thrown out the window altogether. We have the ability to redesign all things, and this hardwiring of self-sabotage and psychic attacks from ourselves and other entities, we can remove it all together. We are in full control. And I will leave on that note. If this resonates with you, please enjoy. Please subscribe to our channel. Like and share our channel, please. Be blessed, scribes.